Organizers of a new women's improv group in Charlottetown say it is no joke how popular their group has become. When Kirsten Lund and Patty Larson put out the call for the witty group in January, they had more than 40 women sign up. They're back this fall with not just one, but two improv groups. The Witty Mama Performance Troupe, taking to the stage this Saturday night at the Guild. Island Morning's Nancy Russell dropped by a practice session to find out what is so many women looking for laughs. Okay, slow-mo commentary. Jeanette, you're up. A fly swatter is the topic of our competition. Well, welcome everybody to our fly swatting extravaganza 2015. I'm Kirsten Lund. I'm Patty Larson, and together we're the founders of Witty, Women Improv Thrown Together Yo. It was Kirsten's idea, as it always is. Last winter, she suggested uh, it would be awesome to have women's comedy back in PEI. There hasn't been a women's improv troupe since the Fight Club. Uh, I was a member of that for five years, and so it was a natural thing for me to say yes, because that's what you say in improv. The response has been phenomenal. It's going to be a great day. I've been awake since 5 a.m. anticipating the outcome of this fly swatting competition. Let's take a look over at our, our, our competitors here. That's Mary Machiknik. M- Machiknik? M- 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 yes. Oh, from the yes. Machiknik Farms in Ponal. You know her. I do yes. know them, and there's a lot of flies down there. When I first put it on Facebook, I had about 75 women say that they were interested. So Patty and I thought, well, let's do a four-week session four weeks for $20 and thinking that that would eliminate some people, you know, that maybe weren't as committed. We still had 43 women that uh, signed up. Okay. We've got, Oh, look at this. Look at this. Creeping up. Look at this. Look at this. Creeping up from behind. This has turned physical folks at home. I don't know if you are seeing what we're seeing. She's going down. She's going down. They are after her. Well, it's the opportunity to come out with a bunch of really fabulous women and just play for a couple of hours. We don't get that opportunity. You know, we're tied up with family and work and responsibilities. This is a chance to have some really amazing belly laughs and get physical without feeling like you're at a gym or working out. But it's actually an excellent workout because you're running around like a crazy person for two hours. (laughs) We're going to cut to a commercial break. We're going to count the flies and we'll be back to you with the exciting news of the fly swatting winner. My name is Lisa Jamani. I've been involved with the improv group since it first began, I think, in January. The appeal, I guess, was just to get out and be silly after a really long eight-hour day of being very plain and uptight. Improv allows you to sort of be silly, and it's great because everyone else's silliness is coming out at the same time, too. So you had fun with that one? Yeah. Yeah. Excellent. Yeah, she has a fly in her hair. (laughs) We decided this year that we wanted to evolve a little bit, so we became Witty Mama, uh, which is a play on the phrase Mother Wit. I don't know if you've heard that. Uh, Mother Wit is that inherent sense that you're born with. Um, So it's a play on that. And Witty Mama now has uh, performance classes and basics classes. So Nancy McClure teaches the performance class. We have about 15 women in that. And they've all taken the the basics. And Patty is is teaching the basics. And we have, I believe, 15 women in that as well. We probably shouldn't try something new right now. (laughs) But this is how we learn. Well, quite honestly, this will be my third show on the 24th. And I honestly don't remember any of our performances. It's like the adrenaline kicks in and you're just on autopilot. And I guess when you're in practice, you go through the drills and you go through the exercises and you feel the vibe of the rest of your troop. But when it comes down to an actual performance, uh, the, the adrenaline kicks in. You become a completely different person. And then you wake up in the morning, you don't remember what happened. And there's no hangover. There I am. Oh, well, you know, hanging in midair can do that. Just let it, yes. let it shake, let it shake, let okay. it shake. Yes, shake it off. yes. Shake it off. Very good. Well, we'd really like to try not only improv, but as we move forward, we want to try all different kinds of comedy. So uh, we're looking at getting a sketch comedy teachers to come in and show us, you know, what's what in that department and stand up comedy and, and anything that we can try that will forward women's comedy in PEI. 
What do you love about improv? Everything. I love saying yes. I love playing. I love jumping up and down. I love being crazy. I love the freedom of being able to do whatever it is I want to do. Uh, the support of the other women in the troupe. I mean, it's a improv is a gift. You know, every every scene you go into, you have no idea what's going to happen, and you're engaged with these amazing women who have no idea what's going to happen either. And yet, we seem to make it work, and and it's just brilliant. What I love about improv is that it's uh, scary and helps you grow. And I think saying yes in improv makes it easier to say yes to other things. You know, if you can get up and do that, especially in front of an audience, a paying audience, then, you know, being at work and, and maybe... Um, leading a seminar or um, maybe taking up a new sport that you've always wanted to try. I think that those things just become easier uh, when you say yes uh, to improv. I love it! I love it! It's the best thing I've ever tasted! But there's going to be trouble! Oh, too much! There seems to be tons of men engaging in this kind of thing here on the island, which is fantastic, um, but there's not a whole lot of, of women engaging in it, at least that we had experience with, and so it was just a way for us to, to engage with more really incredible women, which we both love to do. I've created opportunity for women to play golf together, to do roller derby together. I think that, in my experience, women are more likely to, to say yes and to try new things when it's all women. Tomato soup. Everybody needs their... Screw the spices! Tomatoes, a little bit of cream, some water, puree. Stir it all up. You know, Let deep down simmer. inside all of us, at some point in time when we were kids, we wanted to be actresses or we wanted to be on the stage or we wanted to perform and there's no judgment and we get to perform and people laugh at us we're pretty funny spiders and tomato bread i mean and tomatoes i mean bread <laughs> The Witty Mama Troupe, hosting a night of improvisational comedy in Charlottetown this Saturday, October the 24th, in partnership with the Guild. All proceeds will go to PEI Family Violence Prevention Services, and you can check out a video of the group in action on our CBC PEI website.